Um, I actually just figured it out. Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. That's crazy. I get why you and your classmates to stand up here. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage, from the Native Americans who founded this land to the pioneers who shared it in peace, not fear and violence. You know a lot about Blackwell for being the science teacher. Science is history, Max. And I have a secret wish to teach local lore and legends. There's a lot of unique facts about this you might really enjoy discovering. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Absolutely. I'll sign it. Yeah. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. Because you do what I say, like a puppet. This action will have consequences. Oh. Hello, son. Did you remember to brush your teeth today? All right. Oh. Hmm. Our journal. Photo oh. out. Always mind if I portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous falling soldier? Hmm. Gotta be Eugene, Eugene Smith. Smith. Well, they both were famous war photographer images, but you should know the difference. Good try. Wrong answer. Okay. Hey, Evan. Mind if I... Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Okay. Not Eugene Smith. Robert, Robert Kappa. Kappa, of course. I love his work, despite the controversy about that photo. My, my. This quiet child knows things. That's why I'm here. You're a kindred spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? It's not a privilege I grant to many. I'd be honored, sir. Oh, I can't wait. These photos are great. And Rachel Amber's face is mesmerizing. Wait, that's it? It's supposed to be a privilege to look at this crap? Whatever. Clever. Really? That's, that's all you guys say about that. Uh, hello? Max, I don't feel like talking. What's wrong? Nathan Prescott, little rich bitch kid. He thinks he can own people like his parents own Blackwell. Like he owns the Vortex Club. Yes, he's a nasty piece of work. Somebody needs to take that prick down. It'll happen. Karma doesn't play favorites. Yeah, history yeah, always proves point. that, right? Just wait for justice, you sheeple. Oh, actually, can I just get a better... Uh, hello? Right again. Mac What's wrong? Nathan Press... Yes, he's un... Somebody needs to take... He'll take himself down. Yeah, history always proves that, right? Just wait for oh justice, my God. you sheeple. Whatever. What was the point of rewinding? Yeah. 
you're laying out on the ground. And you got n and you got none. Okay. Okay. Whatever. Daniel is always drawing something. He makes me look like an extrovert. What's up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I um ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. And porn sites. I'd be honored, Daniel. Makes me feel like a muse. Funny you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse. Rachel Amber. Oh, yeah. So what happened to her? There's got to be a story. She just stopped coming to class. Some people said she ran away. Some say she jumped off a cliff. I just hope she's okay. You knew her? No, but once she asked me to draw her portrait. Oh, she was a natural. Hard to avoid her posters all over campus. Kills me to see her sweet face used as a crime photo. Ah, she had a good heart. Okay, why don't you start drawing me? Even though I must be a step down from Rachel. No way, you're a good substitute muse. Oh, that's a good posture. Good. Good. You didn't really have to pose like that. It was really just the shoulders up. Action will have consequences. Okay. I will... I can speak to her. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? I think so. We're lucky to have such a famous teacher. And I actually love his work. Me too. His New York urban stuff is great, but I'm glad he came back to his Oregon roots. Screw the East Coast elite. It must piss off those pretentious galleries that Mark Jefferson is teaching photography to us Blackwell Hicks. Plus, he is pretty hot for an older guy. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely you make a move. You are high school kids. I mean, I guess Max is 18. You're probably 18, so... Victoria is pretty obvious. I don't think Jefferson is into her. I don't think she's closed the deal, but she's not the only player. Now, how do you know this? You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. Well, I what? that from a good source. So, <laughs> I'm just going to say interesting. Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids like Victoria. Yeah, that person. Not my kind of yes. clique. But I heard insane stories about Rachel. And that's 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 I, I okay whatever. I talk to these people. Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to thrash. Oh yeah, bring it. What's your first move gonna be? Uh, jump. You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. Yo, Justin. Check out the map. I came to nose slide. But I'd love to see somebody do a tree flip. Oh, sick. You're not a poser. Nah, I just can't skate worth shit. Aw, oh, check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. What do you want to see? 
I'd love to no see slide. a... No slide. No slide. Let's get Trevor all over that action. <laughs> That's it. I'm not a skater and I can do that. Actually, probably not. I'd pr pr probably destroy my knee. I could go for a burger now. Well then. I've never seen so many missing persons posters for the same person. Brooke actually has a drone? Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? A weapon, right? Uh, you read oh too many conspiracy God. sites. <laughs> this might be too complicated for you. Funny. Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. A weapon. Uh, you... Hmm. I guess we can't... I guess we can't fly a drone. That's unfortunate. Poster. They sure get a lot of mileage out of otter power. What? Otter power? I'm so not there. And this is where the otters perform their aquatic magic. Posters over posters? Somebody really wants to find Rachel Amber. I mean, apparently she really now means a lot to people. Now I have to go back to, to the dorm. This day never ends. Warren's waiting for me and his flash drive in the parking lot, so I better get back to my dorm. Well, where do I go? Do I go downstairs? Warren's waiting for me and his flash drive in the park. I don't lot, go here. So I better get back to my dorm. Crap, I don't know where to go then. I'm pretty sure everything's right just the school, right? I can search her back. Wait a minute. What a complicated name for such a tiny drone. Huh. Sorry, Max. I have to focus on making sure this drone doesn't crash. Hi, I know a lot about drones. Let me get. That looks like a high fly drone. Model B400 EVO. Now that's a nice piece of tech. You're full of surprises. Why would you know that? I love aerial photography. Drones are perfect for that, especially those with great range. It's a new era of images. Most impressive, Max. Warren said you were multifaceted. Here, give the drone a whirl around campus. I'm actually not controlling this, by the way. Where's Victoria? We'll just fly this straight into her face. Oh! It's crash crashes it right into the ground. Do you even have very good control over this drone? Oh, you almost hit that. What is that face on that poster on the left there? Hello. I just been making my way through here, sir.
Are we done yet? I think it just goes around that circle, so. Oh. That's cool. Question is, how do I get to the parking lot? I mean, that's the swimming pool, right? Rachel Amber. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened to her. Man. Because... This is just a school, right? It's not dorms. Yeah, I can't get in there. That'd be this way, then. Dormitories. Yeah, go to the dormitories. Come on, Logan. Bring it, bro. I need to go to my room and return Warren's flash drive. Ow. No, bro. You can't take a picture. You gotta wait till Friday's game. Oh, that throw. Baker, Baker may show Max. you up, sir. Big football. Step away. Nice. Howdy, Samuel. Well, hello there. Oh my god, this guy is creepy. Awesome. What's up with these Rachel Amber posters? But only she would know that, right? This guy is sketch. Uh, I guess. It just makes the campus look sad. You can't color over that sunlight. You knew Rachel? How can you know a prison? You just stare in awe. Now I have to go paint nice, windows. Bro. What do you think happened to her? Best not to dwell on the past. Samuel looks forward. Like a clock. Yeah, he speaks to himself and like nice, bro. speaks to himself as like a third person. What was she like? She must have been popular. Even sunlight can cast shadows. Rachel did both at once, you know. Sweet. She was like a battery. Positive and negative. See you later, Samuel. And watch your step around here, Max. After I sweep, I paint. Odd. No. Oh. Hey, whatever. Dude. Oh. Hi, Max. How are you doing? Fantastic. I'm by myself for eating chiclet. No. Pretty soon I'll be bonding with Victoria at the Vortex Club. I think you're better off reading chiclet. Excuse me. Yeah. Oh, shit. There's Victoria and her mean girls. Oh look, it's Max Caulfield, the selfie hoe of Blackwell. What a lame gimmick. Even Mark, Mr. Jefferson, falls for your wave hipster bullshit. The Daguerrean processor. You could barely even say that. I guess you got your meds filled. <laughs> Since you know all the answers, I guess you have to find another way into the dorm. We ain't moving. Oh, wait. Hold that pose. So original. Don't worry, Max. I'll put a vintage filter on it right before I post it all over social medias. Now, why don't you go fuck your selfie? Oh, yes, Victoria. I'll get your bony ass out of my way. I don't want to mess with that ladder and hurt poor Samuel. I just want to get Victoria the hell out of the way.
I could crank the sprinkler up and give Victoria and her clones incentive to beat it. Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking oh, outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. Not Sorry, so. no paparazzi allowed. Let's see if this works. Excuse me, Samuel. Make my way through here. I'm not doing nothing. What the hell? Are you kidding? Look at this. Chill, Victoria. It's just water. Yeah, water on my cashmere. Do you know how much this fucking outfit costs? You look great. I can't even chill on the steps. <laughs> no way! No fucking way! Oh, Samuel, we're sorry. Wet, wet paint is not good for hair, no? Get the hell away from me, weirdo! Uh. Hold on, hold on. We'll get some towels. We'll be right back. So move your ass before I dry. It worked. Don't mess with Max, bitches. Oh, yeah. Uh, hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? Well, we'll be the good I guy, I guess. I am sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. No. But there'll be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and... and the go-fuck-yourselfie. That was mean, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Yeah. Au revoir. Victoria probably played me. I should have played her. Better get to my room before I find Warren. All right. Did the game just crash? Go, Miss Grant. Not sure if I will, though. I'm a loser. Hurry, Courtney. Blackwell isn't that big, but it sure feels like a labyrinth. Welcome to Black Hill. Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Truly pathetic. Room 217? No way in hell am I ever going in here. I'd love to make a photo collage of every person who've posted these. People here are merciless. Hey, 
And Juliet, extreme reporter. Dane is still a cheerleader at heart. This girl must have been popular. She's everywhere. Nice atmospheric shot. Needs dusting. Could be fun. Glad I'm not the only lonely nerd around here. Thanks for the warning. We get it, she's missing. Somebody has gone crazy with these posters. They live. Okay. Okay, this is just mean and stupid. The action wife. What? This is like the public DNA of our dorm. What is that? Meat is still murder. Wow. That's interesting. How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Oh, Victoria, give me a fucking break. But what's this poster really trying to tell me? Warren should be all over Brooke. They're perfect for each other. Okay. Home sweet home, hmm. my favorite cocoon. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. When I swallowed your eye and my parents rushed me to the ER, I knew we were bonded forever. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know oh you've my got God. my back. When I swallowed your eye and my parents rushed me to the ER, I knew we were bonded forever. So cheesy, but it makes me smile thinking of the day Mom and I sewed that together. <sighs> Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Hey, episode five is now loading. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the Space Needle. Don't you know Philip Lorca de Corsia, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Great, now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. Daniel has so much talent. I hope nobody hates on it just because it's me. I am so addicted to this site. Look at these vintage beauties. When, hey guys, it's a porn site. Warren Ignore makes the me laugh. Camera. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. 
looking through Finder, a window. I'm looking through a window. Would Man Ray call them selfie portraits? It's not exactly pretty in pink, but no shits are given. I love that mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday and slipped in a $200 gift certificate. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of The October Country. I should have every Bradbury book for myself. Now here we go, singing. My science teacher's fat. My science teacher's fat. All right, all right, whatever. Let's just let get the food at. Okay, whatever. Let's just keep going. Oh. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Hey, Juliet, is everything cool? Oh yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. You are ridiculous. What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Ouch. How did you, you find out? out uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Juliet Watson. Watson. Duh. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. I got of it? Of course I do. Just because I don't talk a lot doesn't mean I oh don't care. Oh my god! I got on a first so try. So how did you Watson. find out about them? According to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. Just, According to Victoria? I just kind of tapped huh. A. She saw the sext. And Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go. Straight to hell. Matt. Oh, well, where's Victoria's Answer room? You. I'll give Victoria boom. This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. This better convince Juliet that Dana is innocent. Let's play a little photo Tetris and leave Victoria a message. Let's move this here. And this one there. Hmm, a pattern oh. is emerging. Moving on. Juliet, read this. Of course. I'm an asshole. I'm sorry, Dana. You are. And I hope so. You really think I'd mess around with Zachary? No, but I get stupid jealous. I owe you dinner. Still love me? And you do my laundry. Thanks, Max. You're like the Blackwell Ninja. Now let's see what Zach has to say about Victoria. You set me free. <laughs> Thank you. Warren's flash drive is on my desk. Almost done. Get the flash drive and then I'll go see Warren. Pregnancy test, oh crap. Must protect oh, my precious, so Max never has to chase it down again. What am I playing? Alright, well, well, let's get out of here. Actually, can I go back in the room and do stuff?
want to make sure. Oh wait, there's a. Oh, I could water this. You are thirsty. I'm the worst baby mama. Drink up. Oh my god. This action will have consequences, huh? Yeah, it turns out. It turns out if you keep doing that, the plant will end up being the final boss. Let's get out of here. I feel like Alyssa and I should be better friends. Oh, Damn, crap. I better rewind. Fuck this shit. I feel like Alyssa and I should be better friends. Oh, Jesus. Alyssa, move your head. If you insist, Max. Uh. Now that's what I'm talking about. I actually helped somebody. Sir, did you have your Flintstones today? Okay, I'm just gonna keep going. Go to the parking lot. So don't think I'm blind. I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. Well, intervene. Hey, no. why don't you leave her alone? Excuse us, this is official campus business. Excuse me, you shouldn't be yelling at students or bullying them. Hey, hey, nobody is bullying anybody. I'm doing my job. No, you're not. You're part of the problem, Missy. I will remember this conversation. Hmm. Oh, Max, that was great. I think you scared him for once. I, I have to go, but thank you. It means a lot. Anytime, Kate. I felt like an everyday hero helping Kate, but now Officer David Dickhead is after me. stepped in that time. I don't can't care. stand to see people How being bullied. Do that? Hi, Juliet. How are you doing? Oh, hey, Max. Sorry, I'm still screwed up. Sorry you had to find out about Zachary that way. Or anyway. Better sooner than later. Now that skank Victoria won't be laughing behind my back anymore. Have you talked to Zach yet? Mr. Badass Football Hero is such a chicken shit. He said he sexed Victoria as a joke. Ha ha. I think Warren as a joke? wants your attention. He Sounds like something. <laughs> you know what? You hear excuses like See that on like Maury. Like sometimes it gets that bad. And you have to do watch Maury. You to, there's like so many lame excuses. Like that child can't be mine. I can't make girls. At least Rachel Amber has people who care about her. Sure she does. These old piece of junk cars, by the way. Look at this little thing. He's a crap. This one doesn't look terrible. Come on over here, please. Look at Warren in his way back machine. He's a brave man. What up, Max? How are you? Here's your flash. Thanks. Oh crap. No problem. <laughs> Check out my new wheels. Cool, very old school. 1978 to be exact. Now we can go to the drive-in. There's one in Newburgh just 60 miles away. You're in the wrong time, Warren. But then, so am I. You okay? 
It's been one strange fucking day. I bet. I heard Victoria got a face full of paint. I'd pay money to see a photo of that. Really? I wish I would have known. You probably could have raised a Kickstarter fund just for that one image of her covered in paint. Had I known that. Anyway, Victoria took down my photo, so that drama ended well. By the way, I saw Daniel's sketch of you online. Not bad, but I could do a much better job. You can draw? I thought you were blinded by science, not art. Art is science. Music is math, et cetera, et cetera. I'd put Stephen Hawking against Picasso any day. Hardcore. So you must use a computer to draw? Of course. I'd love to tweak one of your selfies with some cool graphics. That might not suck. I'll let you know. So did you get a chance to check out the movie booty on my flash drive? Yeah, thanks. You had some cool shit on there, from Akira to Twilight Zone, which seems apropos today. I consider myself a pop cultural pirate connoisseur. That does sound better than thief. Ha ha. Make sure this you watch Cannibal is, Holocaust. This guy is friend zoned to the max right now. Seen it. I was more disturbed by all those emo vampire movies in there. Can a sensitive high school boy love sensitive vampires too? So you're sensitive. Ouch, that sounds awful the way you say it. No, I was impressed you had faster pussycat kill kill. Russ Mayer was a genius of black and white. Plus, babes with breasts. Who would beat your sensitive ass down? If I was lucky. Speaking of hip and fast, we should cruise out in my car to an actual movie this week. But you seem distracted. I need to talk to somebody, just to get it out of my system. Dr. Warren Graham is in the house. I won't even prescribe you any meds. Tell me everything. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me, not social media. Don't insult me. Max, go on. I had this incredibly bizarro experience in Mr. Jefferson's class today. I mean, life-changing. Have you ever had a dream so real it was like a movie? Max Caulfield, right? You're one of the Jefferson's photo groupies? I'm- I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. Oh, what the fuck ever? I know you like to take pictures, especially when you're hiding out in the bathrooms. You best tell me what you saw, now. Answer me, bitch. What are you talking about? I know you're new here, but don't even play stupid with me. I'm not new, I've lived here for years. Then you should know the Prescotts own this shithole. Then you don't have to worry about me, worry about yourself. Do not analyze me. I pay people for that. Worry about yourself, Max Caulfield. <laughs> he pays people to analyze. Take a step back, Nathan Prescott. Oh man, you're telling me what to do? Get away from her, dude! Hey, leave him alone! Nobody tells me what to do. 
Not my parents, not the principal, that. or that whore Wait, in the bathroom! No. <gasps> Max? Chloe? No way. You again. Warren! Go! Go! I got this! Get in, Max! <laughs> Get your punk asses out of there now! Don't even try to run! Nobody! Nobody! Oh my god. Crazy. Man. Nathan Prescott is messed up. And dangerous. This day never ends. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. Don't give me the guilty face. At least pretend you're glad to see me. I am seriously glad to see you. Oh, and thanks, Chloe. It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Yes, it's been that kind of day. So what did that freak want with you? Hopefully nothing after today. So, how do you know Nathan? He's just another Arcadia asshole. Your friend really took a beat down for you. Warren? Yeah, I owe him big time. You're not the only one in debt. And you're already causing trouble. I thought it would be quiet here. It feels so weird to be back. So I guess Seattle sucked hard? No, it felt like a real city for artists. Big and bright. Great for taking pictures. Yeah, must be hard coming back to a hick town like Arcadia again. Not after seeing you. Please, girl. You came back for Blackwell Academy. Of course, it's one of the best photography programs in the country. And my favorite teacher, Mark Jefferson. So you came back to Arcadia for a teacher, not your best friend. You, just, you still Don't mentioned you him in that sentence. I picked the left no. one, not the you right one. You were happy one. to wait five years without a call or even a text. I'm sorry. I know things were tough on you when I left. How do you know? You weren't even here. I didn't order my parents to move specifically to fuck you over, Chloe. You've been at Blackwell for almost a month without letting me know. Enough said. I just wanted to settle in first and not be such a shy, cliché geek. I totally would have contacted you. I bet you don't use these sad excuses on Mr. Jefferson. Don't use them on me, Max. I haven't heard that one in a while. Wow! Not everything changes. Except my camera has officially taken a shit. My step douche has a boatload of tools. Are you Maybe you can fix it in my I place. I need very specific tiny tools. Man, I heard alert. Heard like a my stepdad has a fully stocked garage. Then I still barely and he actually heard is it. a tiny tool. Just it was, just Welcome it home, Max. Very cheesy. in don't be shy the house still looks nice home shit home My room looks a bit different than the last time you saw it. It's cool. At least we can chill out. This isn't exactly my chill out zone. My step fear makes sure of that. Come in and close the door. Put on some music while I medicate. Music, huh? It won't play without any power. Look at that. Chloe and her dad were so close. Oh my god.
Damn, Chloe does need a lot of money to get out of Arcadia. Hey, that TV used to be in the living room. This postcard is from Rachel Ember. We had such a blast drawing these together. And it reeks like dirty laundry. Gross. <gasps> Dude, you broke my glass snow dough. Chloe totally changed her style. I barely recognized her. Chloe was always taller than me. We made her dad keep track of her height. Give me that. Mm. Sorry, I wasn't trying to be nosy. Obviously, she was a good friend. It's putting it mildly. Man, I had no idea. Well, you never made much effort to find out. I was 14. We were best friends. I never forgot. Even if I was an asshole and didn't keep in touch. But you had Rachel. Rachel had my back. We were gonna kick the world's ass. You would laugh at how different we were. She wanted to be a star. She looks like a model. That was her plan. Our plan. Get the hell out of Bigfootville and into Los Angeles. So what happened? Did your folks, your mom, try to stop you? My mom was too busy hooked up with Sergeant Shithead. I feel the love. Now. When did Rachel actually disappear? Six months ago. She just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. How do you know she disappeared? Maybe she wanted to start a totally new life. Unlike you, she would have told me, okay? Something happened to her. I believe you. I'm just trying to get all deductive. Before Rachel left, she said she met somebody who changed her life. And poof. And you haven't heard anything from her since? Like everybody in my life. My dad, you, and Rachel. Gone. Can you put on some music now? Oh, this is a flashback to youth. Our super secret closet lair. Okay, well, let's. Wait, where's the radio? That, this is a radio. Any power. Wait, without any power? Anyway, you can find tools to fix your camera in the garage. Chloe, are you okay? Sure, I'm awesome. I just want to blaze and be alone for a moment. Wow. <laughs> uh, oh my god. Okay.
game does have a lot of feeling to it, though. Whoa, dark. I cannot see anything. Oh my god, fine. Turn the light on. You might not have saw it, but she actually did turn that light switch on. This is definitely Joyce's makeup. Chloe wouldn't use animal products. I wonder if Chloe is taking those pills. I hope she's okay. I like Chloe's new hair color. She's the opposite of shy. Of me. You can't go home again, said Thomas Wolf. But here I am. This must be Chloe. <laughs> Man, I'm nosy today. Oh my god. Open a window. <laughs> that was hilarious. Are you serious? You've been resurrected, Birdie. Fly, be free. Joyce always loved her mail order catalogs of useless crap. Hmm. What's this? Uh oh. The prices are late on their bills. That's. Just turn a lamp on. Oh, a photo. Joyce looks happy. Chloe's stepdad might not be a douchebag after all. Oh, he really is a douchebag. Uh, open a drawer. Dog tags. Sweet. David Matson. Really? We're making a big deal out of that book. Act, react, or die. A 21st oh God, century survival guide. Oh my. Chloe made this for Joyce on Mother's Day years ago. I see why she would keep it. Joyce still works at the diner. And Chloe's new dad is a security guard. <laughs> uh oh. Very interesting. You know, These the dialogue books have not been touched since the last decade. I see why. Nothing's changed, except for me and Chloe. Wait, what? Oh, I think that's Chloe's room. Okay. Press A to go down these stairs in particular. Hey, I don't know where that would take me. Doesn't look like the Price family is rolling in dough these days. Oh my god! Oh, Kate. Um, journal. By the way, thanks, but we're not. F I should. Oh my god, I should have taken the picture. <sighs> I'd love to go to Paris, too. At this rate, they'll be lucky to get to Portland. Joy still works at Two Wheels Diner. Best damn burgers in Arcadia. I better get one soon. I haven't seen this place in five years. Seems like forever. Yum, that looks tasty. I do miss Joyce's cooking. Brr. I can feel autumn pushing out the summer. 
William used to grill awesome burgers for us. I wonder I if he was the last one to use this. We made this grave for Chloe's kitty. Poor Bongo. He never saw that car. We made this grave for Chloe's kitty. Oh. Poor Bongo. The cat. He never saw that car coming. Oh God. That took Chloe and me the whole day to draw. It's almost invisible now. What do you truly want to do when you grow up? Max, I'm already grown up. What about you? Travel. That would be awesome. Explore the world, go far from here. Far from me? Thanks a lot, dude. Dude, you would totally come with me. I need a bodyguard for our adventures. I would be like Lara Croft, except real. That would be majorly cool. Totally. We'd have cars and boats and planes all over for instant escape. And no adults could tell us what to do. Oh, someone just messaged Count me. Count me in. What would you do while I was bodyguarding you? Maybe take pictures of our adventures. I would love oh. to be a photographer. I'm sorry, man. I didn't see your messages. Spor what are you talking Spor about? Spor Bond for Max, four you are a photographer. Four, so. Your pictures could be in a museum. Someday they will. I believe in you. Oh, crap, it's just some... Okay. 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 Get up. Okay, so I guess it's somewhere inside I gotta go. So I guess I can come in here and start looking at more stuff. I was a little worried. Like, Hey, I remember that stain. Chloe and I knocked over Joyce's wine bottle and we scrubbed forever, but it never came out. We got so busted. Come on, open it, chicken. Hold on, and I'm not chicken. Prove it. You drink first, Max. No way. It was your idea, Chloe. Whatever. Give me that bottle. Well? Tasty. Very tasty. Here, I, I want a sip. Oh my god. Sorry, this is not for kids. Don't be greedy. Give me some. <laughs> oh shit, the carpet! There's wine all over. What do we do now? My parents are coming. Cover it up. Cover it up. <laughs> oh. Honestly. Oh, I guess they couldn't afford it because I guess they were over 200 bills. I was going to say, like, I mean, probably could have replaced the carpet, but they probably couldn't afford to do that. Chloe, if you're listening. Pete was cruising home off duty and told me he saw you near that garbage dump. Now I've ordered. Told you to stay away from that place. It's dangerous. And you got no idea what kind of scum are living out there. Stay away. I'm serious. Okay, he's done. What's this door over here? It's nope. open. Someone locked it from the other side. Well, then. I was so curious about that door, but it turns out it's just. Okay, whatever. I guess they're aging these books. I should be able to find the tools I need here. Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. He wants to put surveillance be rough, cameras man. all over the school. How you paranoid can you get? But then again, I guess if the guy's not a douchebag, then I don't, I don't think he would actually Chloe's stepfather is this that asshole bad. from Blackwell? Know. You've got to be shitting me.
The guns deserve to be sh shown. Yes, score. You were not the one that threw those darts. What the? Chloe's Whoa. stepdad actually installed cameras in the rooms? For reals? This guy has serious trust issues. Do uh, Chloe and Joyce even know about this? I would be this? moving out. Like, I'm gone. Like, I'm out of there. See you later. That's creepy, though. These are way too big. I need tiny tools for that camera. Laptop. No password. Like it would help me find tools anyway. Hey, episode two just got installed. Some snacks up there. Shit! Butterfingers! Always make them fall. Kate Marsh? Why the hell would he have pictures of her? Okay, this is getting totally weird. Uh, that's not creepy at all. But I remember there being like a map here, though. Wowzer, a map of Blackwell Academy. I wonder why. Look at all that food. That's like enough spam for a hundred years. Check out the muscle car. Chloe's stepdad must be a gearhead. Oh, I know where I go. That goes back into like the main room. But I'm trying to find the tools though. This. Poor little deer. It's not enough to kill you. They have to display your head. I get it, there's food there. Okay. So it doesn't look like it looks like it's in there. Chloe's stepfather is this asshole from Blackwell? You've gotta be Chloe's stepdad is head of security at Blackwell. He wants to put surveillance cameras all over the school? Nothing. This is so lame. Are you serious? These are way too many times. No password. Like it would help me find tools anyway.
Okay, I need to figure this out. I might have to look this crap up. Cause here I am, look, literally looking. Boom, precision screwdrivers. Except I can't reach them. Oh. That was very smart, dumbass. No can reach. Push. Okay, now turn on, now turn it on. Yes, you have mad skills, Max. Okay, we're gonna start heading I've up to Chloe's tools. room. I should go back upstairs before Chloe freaks. Yeah, all right, now go upstairs. So? I can't fix this thing. Are these your new photos? Yeah. I just took them today. Let me see. Wait. I've seen this before. Uh, no way. When did you take this? You took this photo, you brat? In the bathroom today. You set off the alarm. That's why Nathan raged after you. It totally makes sense. You hella saved my life. Now tell me the truth, Max. Me? I wasn't sure. I know I was scared, too. I, I couldn't see straight. I don't blame you, Max. Like you said, it's been that kind of day. So you must have overheard our conversation. Just a bit. There is no way you didn't hear every single vowel. Okay, I only heard something about money, drugs, but that's it. Now for the big question, anybody? No, I didn't know what to do. I don't blame you. That's some intense shit. Maybe I should go to the principal. The principal? Are you still 12? That drunk jackass only cares about cash for Blackwell Academy. Don't trust him. Seriously, I didn't blab to anybody. Promise. Thank God. I'll tell you more someday. And I seriously owe you, Max. I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. This was my real father's camera. I want you to have it. That's so cool you remembered my birthday, but I can't take this. Of course you can. My dad would be pissed if I never used it, and now I know it'll be used awesomely. And I'll snag this picture as a symbol of our reunion. Cool? Yes, of course it's cool. Thank you. This camera is so sweet. Now that we got that mushy shit out of the way, I feel like stage diving. Let's thrash uh -huh. this place. You're crazy. Yep, yep, I'm fucking insane in the brain. Let's dance. Shake that bony white ass. Or take my picture with your new camera. <laughs> this day couldn't get any stranger. Browser encounters something. This song fucking oh, rules. Refreshing. Can't dance, hippie? Come on. Rock out, girl. I'm gonna close this right here. Yes! Break it down, Max. Yo, turn it off! Turn it off! 
times have I told you to stop blasting that punk shit? Dude, the music's not even on! Asshole. I'm coming up. We need to talk. Oh, no fucking way. You need to hide now. My stepdad will kill me if he finds you here. Chloe, what's going on? Open this door, please. Chill, I'm changing. Is that okay? Max, find a place to hide now. <sighs> Chloe. I'm coming. What are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing. Give me a minute. Don't get smart. Just let me in now. Chloe? I'm coming! What are you doing? Chloe, you're stalling. I'm changing! Give me a minute! Don't get smart. Just let me in. Now. Once my this I'm just trying on clothes. You're so friggin' annoyed. Yeah, combat, we'll do that. Oh my god. One of my guns is missing. Did you I'll take your stupid gun? You do know I believe in gun con- Is that grass? You've been token up again- Guns, weed? You were tripping- I'm sick of your disrespect. Tell me the truth. That- That- Well, I don't- just um, See drugs into my- But if I- Please, screw up your spotless record. You do seem to get around, Max. I'm sick of you losers dragging Chloe down. Missy, you sure do like to pop up and start trouble. Like this after you think smart to say now. Hell away from huh? her man harassing my friends. You don't have any f like you know. You're not even a real hard. I was a soldier, Chloe. And Max, if I see you here again, you'll learn all about real trouble. Because you're such a badass, Max, let me show you my new toy. Okay. I'm Price. Chloe Price. Bang! What Jesus, the put that thing down. Chillax, sister. It's not even loaded. Yet. I thought you believed in gun control. Yes, I believe I should control the gun. It's the men who need to be checked. You trust Excuse Nathan me? or David? Thanks for taking the heat. We totally smacked his punk ass down, Max. He's no match for you and me now. That was an epic win. Anyway, let's sneak out the window. There is one cool place we can hang in this hickle. Man, that did not go well for me. If I want to keep my Blackwell scholarship, I shouldn't lie for anybody, even Chloe. That's I have fine. to think about my own future. Awesome sauce? Totally reminds awesome. me of when we were kids. Slow poke? Hold on. Nobody's... I haven't been here in forever. I should remember that it's been like a decade so why do since I feel somebody like it was said just here? awesome sauce. Whoa. This is the exact same path I was on during my nightmare today. I feel like I'm in my nightmare again. It's just some trash. Oh, Bruce crap, Warren. So lucky. Wowzer. Chloe drew that to mark our tree for it. Oh my so god. So we always be able to find each other in case of emergency. Wowzer. <sighs> Wowzer. She actually just said Wowzer. 
I really gotta look up when this game came out. It might have been like 2014. Looks like, like the that. youth of Arcadia Bay still come up I here to like party. I feel like it might have been like 20. I never made it. You sure you don't want to be alone? Have a seat, Pete. My pleasure. It feels nice out here after all that drama. You really took one for Team Chloe. I'm not as brave as you. And David is indeed a step douche. I'm sorry firsthand. You have to live with him. Has he always been this way? Ever since my desperate mom dragged his ass to our home, I never trusted David. He freaked out on poor Kate Marsh today. I know her. She's cool. Only that prick would bully her. He has some kind of weird agenda. He has a lot of secret files. Rambo still thinks he's gathering enemy intelligence. Did you take a peek? Well, yeah. I couldn't help it. Never change. What did you find? Creepy photos of Kate Marsh. Other Blackwell students. This dude takes his job too seriously. He still thinks he's at war or something. He's a total surveillance fetish. Where are there spy cams in the house? I knew you didn't know. Chloe, your house is under surveillance. What are you talking about? There are cameras all over the house. I saw it on a in the garage. He's so hella annoyed. Keep this a secret for now. Sometimes ignorance is miserable. Every town knows every. What's Nathan's secret? He's an asshole who sells bad shit cut with laxative. And he dosed me with some drug in his room. What? I met him. Should hold. He's too rich for the place and too wasted, and he kept flashing bills. Just tell me what happened. Now. I was an idiot. He was so blazed it would be an easy score. You needed money that bad? Actually, yes. I owe big time. And I thought I'd have enough for me and Rachel if she showed up. How much do you owe? Grand plus interest. And before a chunk of that from Nathan, he dosed my- God, Chloe. I can't believe this. I mean, I do. Then what? I know I passed out on and that perv was smiling. Go on. It was a blur. I tried to kick him in the ball lamp so I would get the hell out. <sighs> Max, it was insane. I am so furious, I can't even speak. What did you do then? I figured I would make him pay me to keep quiet. So we met in the bathroom. And he brought a gun. That was Nathan's last mistake. He's still dangerous, Chloe. Not just to you. Didn't tell anyone. Nathan Prescott better watch his back now. I won't always be there to save you. You were here today. You me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like destiny. Oh my god. If this is destiny, I hope we can find Rachel. This shit pit has taken away everyone I've ever loved. I'd like to drop a bomb on Arcadia Bay and turn it to fucking glass. Like this is 
paper. October 11th is four days away. Oh my god. That tornado is headed straight down. Oh. I'm back my board. It's real, it's real. Oh man, this sucks. What's going on? He totally blacked out. It Wiped out by a tornado. Oregon gets about five tornadoes a year. You just zone. No, no. I could actually feel the electricity in the air. Take a breath, Chloe. I see, but there's have to tell you something. For me, Max. Vision earlier. Us. When I came out of it, I just could reverse time, like I. But right. Listen. To How do you think I saved you in the bathroom by reversing time? Yeah, sure. I saw you get. Saw you die. I was able and hit the fire alarm. Okay, you're a geek now with a great imagination, but this isn't anime or a video game. I don't have those, Max. I don't know what I have, but I have it, and I'm scared shitless. You need to get high. It's been a hell insane fucking day. <gasps> what the hell is this? Snowflakes? It's like 80 degrees. How? Climate change. Or a storm is coming. Max, start from the beginning. Tell me everything. Well then. Okay, so these are my choices. Okay, um... I blame Chloe! What? You blame Chloe? Two percent people did that. Of course that'd be the farm animal. Ugh. Stayed hidden. Wow. I'm the second most minority? I took the blame for Chloe. Wait, I kinda did that though. I kinda did say that. Whatever. Time for Victoria. Yeah, I probably should have made fun of her instead. I intervened to help out Kate. Yeah, I figured I'd be the majority. I hid the truth, which is actually not true. But whatever. Oh, crap. I let Daniel draw the portrait. The minority? Really? I signed Mr. Grant's petition. A far minority. Maybe people just don't find those then. I don't know. Maybe people played them like so many more times and they just kind of like skip. Uh, I, I feel like that's probably what it was. I helped Alyssa. I did. Majority. I erased the insults on Kate's slate. I'm a little bit of a minority, but I feel like a lot of people missed that. That's probably why. I watered the plant. A little bit of the majority. I didn't touch Dana's pre pregnancy test. Okay. 2% did. Yeah, she is so prego. Um... I reorganized Victoria's photos. I am a minority in that. Um, I didn't. I didn't write on dirty RV. Wait, there was a dirty RV to write. I probably should have. Oh, that's that's a shame. I I did save the bird. I am a minority in that. Again, I think people just missed that, or probably just played it so many times they just didn't really care enough. I didn't break glowy snow globe. 
I didn't leave any f evidence. But yeah, I just kind of looked at the pictures and then I just reversed time and put them back. I did read Dave's files. David. Print stats. Okay. Wait. Oh crap. You can't just do that. Oh, on the stream. Bye guys.